Hey, YouTube is okay. 21 here. Well, you know what I'm doing. M my prediction for tomorrow's event. NXT TakeOver. It's Vengeance Day. Oh, still can't believe they brought back another old pay-per-view. <laughs> and it's Vengeance. Man, you call it Vengeance Day on Valentine's Day <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> but uh, let's get to it. Let's get to my prediction. Okay, let's start with <laughs> Johnny Gargano. He'll defend his North American title against Kushida. Mm. See, after what, especially after what he did on trying to do, trying to do on Wednesday, trying to get out of it with a fake injury. Uh, I bet that was not a real expert of his body. Uh, oh, news! Uh, you see, he'll do anything to get, try to keep that title. He uh, can't win all, so yeah, I want Kushida to win. I want Kushida to win. To win back the south. Even means if somehow if Austin Green gets in the way, I sense Dex and Win will be there. I got a feeling. Okay, then we got well, you know, we got two final two finals of the Dusty Wolves Tag Team Classic. Alright, we'll start with the guys. <laughs> start with the guys and it's the newbies. MSK takes on ooh, Young Benjamin. I think you know who I'm talking about. Sad Dr James Drake and Sad Gibson. <laughs> For a week. This is the second time they competed in the finals. Last year, well, they competed last year, but lost to Pete Dunne and Matt Willow. And now, do you think they're going to win this year? <laughs> yeah, right. If we get a couple, well, not all the time, a couple of times, every time we got used superstars that, and they compete in the first takeover, they always win. Hmm. That's why I want, I want MSK to win. This is going to be the big, good way to start their first year. <laughs> to start their first year. Yeah, I want MSK to win. I want MSK to win. <laughs> then let's get to the women's Dusty Classic final. It's Dakota Kai and <laughs> Raquel Gonzalez takes on Amber Moon and Shotzi Blackheart. Ow! ow! I would. Anyway, I was begging all four of them, but I want Amber and Shotzi Blackheart to win. <laughs> also, this will be making history. The first ever winners of the Dusty women's Dusty Classic. Not only they win the cup, they win the cup, but they get a, a title shot, a future title shot for the women's tag team titles. Hmm. Maybe save it for WrestleMania. Hmm. Alright, next we got the triple threat match for the NXT women's title as Evil Shawai defends the title against Mercedes Martinez and Tony Storm. Okay, I I I really want I really, I know I had a feeling that Evil might retain. That's good, but I got a freaky feeling that Tony Storm might win this. I think this is maybe a pushback after what happened in NXT UK. Come on, losing the UK women's title two years ago. And got the bloody destroyed in that last women's title match with Kerry Rain last year. And she was pranked. See how weird your pranked she was after that. She was going to move to America to start her NXT career. But because of pandemic, she she got stuck. Until then, but then she managed to make over the summer. I think Kevin was over the summer or autumn. She managed to make it, stay in Mexico for a while, but then she finally comes to America, and she finally arrived in back in the, back in October. So I think this shit could be her come her comeback. Hmm. Like I said, I want Evil to retain, but I think Tony's gonna win this. Hmm. But if Tony does win this, she'll be the second woman to hold the NXT UK Women's Title and the NXT Women's Title. The first was we are free. <laughs> Then to the main event. Oh, this is a dream match. This is a dream match. <laughs> we want to see it happen. Two UK stars going at it. Finn, the Prince, Finn Bauer. <laughs> he'll, take, he'll defend his NXT title against the Blues away. Pete Dunn. Ooh. Like I said, this is a dream match. Come on. Both champions. Come on. Finn Bauer, first. Let's see. For NXT, two time NXT champion. First ever Universal title. Say so he didn't get this proper rematch. Former Intercontinental Champion. <laughs> was the longest reign NXT Champion. <laughs> Until Adam Cole broke it. And Pete Dunne. <laughs> Second superstar that held the NXT UK Women's title. No, NXT title. <clears throat> Sorry. Second guy to held the NXT title. What? The longest reign NXT Champion. But I don't think not for long. After I heard solo record, Walters is getting close. He's getting close to break Dunn's record. <laughs> oh. Okay, this is gonna be a trick. Oh, this is gonna be a hard one for me. This could be the match of the night, but it's gonna be hard for me because I respect both of them. 
I respect both of them. Oh, that's gonna be tough. Mm, okay, I totally respect Pete Dunn. He is good. So is good. But I got a feeling Finn Balor's gonna retain. And not, not just that. I got a feeling I know someone is gonna be watching. And maybe, just maybe, I want it to be true. But if it's not true, totally understand. But just maybe, I think I know a way that I want one more is watching. And I got a feeling he might show up. And maybe make his decision for WrestleMania. <laughs> okay, I am in that. I want him, I want Edge to pick Finn Balor. I want him to pick the NXT title for WrestleMania. Because I think that would be a dream match if he faced Finn Balor. <laughs> yeah, I said, see, I said it. <sighs> okay, that's my predictions for tomorrow. Well, this will be an interesting Valentine's Day. We'll say I need to get into wed mode <laughs> tomorrow. Oh, I can't, can't wait to watch this. Because, you know, no, let's see, because tomorrow's takeover, and then the week after, it's the Ordination Chamber. Oh. Then we got, then we got Fast Wayne in March, and then April, my favorite, my favorite month, my birthday month, and also WrestleMania in two nights. On my, on my birthday week. <laughs> I'm going to have a fun, I think I may have a fun birthday week. Hopefully, we got beautiful weather that day. Hmm. Alright, so I'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow for my WWE Top 10 reactions and then for NXT TakeOver. Alright, I'll see you, see you later.